नमस्ते प्रिय मित्रानी पुनरपि स्वागतम सो वेलकम वंस अगेन एंड आई एम वेरी ईगर टू शेयर दिस पर्टिकुलर क्लास विथ यू बिकॉज इन द प्रीवियस लेसन वी लुक्ड एट द स्वादी गणा विद द वर्ब्स श्रृणोति एंड शक्नोति एंड हियर्स अन अदर वर्ब दैट यू आर ऑलरेडी फेमिलियर विथ एंड इट हैज़ अ लॉट ऑफ सिमिलैरिटीज सो लेट्स लुक एट टूडेज लेक्चर विच इज लेक्चर नंबर थर्टी टू इट्स एन इंट्रोडक्शन टू द कॉन्जुगेशन ऑफ द वर्ब फ्रॉम क्र टू डू विच यू रियली नो वेल and this is from the tanadi gana uh, but this is from the eighth group so what we've been looking at the group systematically so one to uh, we did it from 2 3 4 5 but now i'm suddenly jumping to the eighth group because i could not uh, help myself from uh, pointing out to you the similarities between these verbs so we look at these in the various tenses and moods uh, this is going to be the tanadi gana the eighth group of verbs and uh, we'll again look at it in the different tenses and moods the vartamana kala bhavishya kala ajnya anadyatana bhuta kala kriyati patilling and the vidhiling and of course uh, the verb, the practice here is going to be around kr uh, and uh, we'll focus on building a vocabulary so the stage is yours tell me the forms of karoti in the vartamana kala kr in the vartamana kala so karoti kurutaha kurvanti karoshi kurutaha kurutha karomi kurva and kurvaha or and kurmaha all right let's look at the forms so karoti so shrunoti karoti kurutaha shrunutaha etc and shrunvanti kurvanti uttamam shrunoshi karoshi kurutha uh, shrunutaha kurutaha shrunutha kurutha shrunomi karomi shrunvaha so you have shrunuvaha which is not there there is no kuruvaha here it's only kur shrunvaha becomes kurvaha and kurmaha uttamam so uh, the next one is the bhavishya kala bhavishya kala bahu saralam asti so karishati karishatah karishanti karishassi karishatah karishya karishatha karishyami karishyavah and karishyamaha now the news about this particular group is that um it is the tanadi gana or the eighth group coming from the root verb uh, uh from the verb root tan meaning to spread tanoti um and uh, the future being tanishyati but what we need to understand is that uh, though there are 10 groups and there is a classification every group doesn't contain the same number of verbs so the bhuadi gana for example and the churadi gana are enormous groups of verbs because most of the verbs belong to these groups uh, the verbs like um, the groups like tanadi gana have really very few verbs and of those verbs we are not very familiar with many but because kr such an important verb belongs to that group it becomes important for us to study it together astu so uh, if you uh, wanted to make a sentence which says so you informal singular do your work well tell me you informal singular twam करोषि किम करोषि कार्यम करोषि कथम करोषि सम्यक करोषि तरी तम कार्यम सम्यक करोषि कस्य कार्यम योर वर्क तव कार्यम सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू मेक दैट होल सेंटेंस तम तव कार्यम सम्यक करोषि सो द वर्ब दिस ग्रुप ऑफ आई मीन दिस पर्टिक्युलर वर्ब अलाउज लॉट्स ऑफ सेंटेंसेस इट इज द बेस वर्ब for making a lot of sentences so if you say uh, you can either say directly i have my bath so you can say aham snami or if you say i take i do my bath then aham snanam karomi aham i eat aham khadami or if i uh, i take my food then aham bhojanam karomi ityadikam so uh, the verb karoti is a very very foundational verb to know by heart very well let's move on so ajnya अनद्यतन भूत एंड द क्रियाति पत्तिल रिंग सो आजनिया इज करोतु कुरुताम कुरवंतु कुरु कुरुतात कुरु अकुरुतात कुरुताम कुरुत करवाणी करवाव करवाम उत्तम और राइट सो इफ यू वॉन्ट टू से ऑल ऑफ यू ऑल ऑफ यू डू योर वर्क वेल हाउ वुड यूज ऑल ऑफ यू do your work well so all of you you yam your work uh, and the verb is kuruta your work yushmakam karyam well samyak so you yam 
युष्माकं कार्यं सम्यक् कुरुत उत्तमं सो इट्स लाइक अ सजेशन देयर तरी ऑल ऑफ यू डू योर संस्कृत स्टडीज वेल डू योर स्टडीज ऑफ संस्कृत वेल हाउ वुड यू ट्रांसलेट दैट ऑल ऑफ यू डू योर संस्कृत डू योर स्टडीज ऑफ संस्कृत वेल यूयम यूयम कुरुत किम कुरुत स्टडीज अध्ययनम कुरुत कस्य अध्ययनम संस्कृतस्य अध्ययनम कथम सम्यक सो यूयम संस्कृतस्य अध्ययनम सम्यक कुरुत सो आई आल्सो लाइक यू टू पुट अ पॉज बटन एंड जस्ट लिसन टू द वे इन व्हिच आई रिकंस्ट्रक्टेड द सेंटेंस फॉर द ट्रांसलेशन सो वन बाय वन यू आस्क हु इज डूइंग इट व्हाट इज द व्हाट इज द पर्सन डूइंग हाउ इज द पर्सन डूइंग वेयर इज द पर्सन डूइंग एंड जस्ट बाय आस्किंग दीस क्वेश्चंस यू कैन कंप्लीट दैट सेंटेंस भूतकाले किं भवति अकरोत अकुरुताम अकुरवन अकरोहो अकुरुतम अकुरुत अकरवम अकुरुव और अकुरव एंड akuruma or akurma asu so that is the bhutakala and i'd like you to make a sentence saying that um he took his food yesterday saha tasya bhojanam akarot kada akarot hyah saha tasya bhojanam hyah akarot okay so he had his food well or if i wanted to say he did his homework yesterday saha tasya homework is griha karyam so tasya griha karyam akarot uttamam let's move on now so uh, just before we move on we have tan becomes tanotu atanot and what would it become in the kriyati patil ring so we have tanishyati for the future and it will become atane atanishyat asu okay so let's move on now uh, we we'll look at the bhutakala and the vidhiling so we have akarot becomes kuryat akurutam kuryatam akurvan kuryuh akaroh so again that and that akaroho becomes kuryaha so again the yaha that's coming in here akurutam akuryatam uh, akuruta kuryata akaravam kuryam akurva akuruva or akurva becomes kuryava and akuruma or akurma becomes kuryama so let's do the vidhiling alone kuryat kuryatam kuryuh kuryaha kuryatam kuryat kuryam kuryav kuryam uttamam and here we have it again tanotu atanot and atanishyat uttamam let's move on so here at uh, this is what a table i wanted to share with you where we have kuryat and shaknuyat side by side okay so the swadi gana and the tanadi gana put side by side and you see the similarities that are there so kuryat shaknuyat kuryatam shaknuyatam kuryuhu shaknuyuhu kuryaha shaknuyaha kuryatam shaknuyatam kuryata shaknuyata kuryam shaknuyam kuryava shaknuyava and kuryam shaknuyam so again if you remember one form and you know that it is similar you can easily apply it in the other context as well let's just make some words here with yada and tada uh, so yada samayah bhavet the first line tada kriditum shaknuya so when there is time then he can play so yada samayah bhavet tada kriditum shaknuya uh, when it is uh, time so when there will be time then he can go to the garden yada samayah bhavet tada vatikam gantum shaknuya uttamam karyam samapnuya so when he finishes his work then he can rest so yada karyam samapnuyat tada vishramam kartum shaknuyat uttamam yada karyam samapnuyat saha vishramam kuryat so he should so when the work is done he must rest so vishramam kuryat is a kind of a emphatic uh, suggestion that he must rest when the work is done and the last one yada samyak pathet 
तदा सह लेखनम कुरियात सो वेन इफ ही स्टडीज वेल देन ही शुड राइट और सह लेखि तुम शक्नुयात एज इट इज रिटन हियर यू कैन ऑल्सो से तदा सह लेखनम कुरियात so he should not write before he has studied well okay that's what it would mean in uh, long and short of it okay so let's move on let's do a conversation namaste arye namaste piyusha ka varta nptl vargartam sarve chhatraah utsahena bahu karyam kurvanti parishramam cha kurvanti uttamam aham api apashyam yat teshu bahavah उत्तम व्याकरण प्रश्नान कुर्वन्ती ती आम श्रुणोतु आर्ये एका समस्या अजायत किम अभवत यदा गत सप्ताहे अहम अंतरयाले चर्चा स्थाने अंतरजाले अंतरजाले चर्चा स्थाने अहम प्रश्नानम उत्तरम अकर्वम तदा अहम अपश्यम दो छात्रो परीक्षार्थम अर्थम दातुम प्रयत्नम आकुरुतम परंतु किंतु किम परंतु तो असफलो आस्तम एवं वा आम अस्तु तर्हि तर्हि वयम इदानीं किं कुरियाम इति चिन्त इति चिन्तयति आम अस्तु अहम् एतदर्थम् एनपीटीएल कार्यालये दूरवाणी दूरवाणीं करवाणी किम आम तत्तु साधु तत् सह उपायः साधु अस्ति अस्तु अनन्तरम् तेन अन्य अपि छात्राः तेषां लाभः भवति इति आम् तर्हि तौ छात्रो ते छात्राः च कथं सारल्लेन पञ्जीकरणं कुर्युः तस्मिन् विषये एकवारं दूरवाणीं करोतु कृपया अवश्यम् अस्तु इदानीं युष्माकं उत्साहार्थम् उत्साहार्थम् भवतः सहायार सहायार्थम् च अहम् अनुग्रहिता अस्मि। So let's do an application of what we've learnt in this verse from the Gita again. So it says, यत् करोषि यदश्नासि यत् जुहोषि जुहोषि ददासि यत् यत् तपस्य सिकाउंते य तत् कुरुष्वम अदर्पणम् So this is in the ninth chapter where Krishna is telling him. Uh, trying to convince him that you know you can uh, do many things but ultimately if you offer it to me I will help you in your uh, in your confusion in your uh, decision making so he says yat karoshi yadashnasi yat karoshi so you break it up there yat karoshi so whatever you do yat ashnasi whatever you eat we have not yet looked at the Ashnasi, which is the Kriyadi Gana with the Na entry there, but we will come to it. Yat Juhoshi. So, Yat Juhoshi, we have already looked at this form. So, Yat plus Juhoshi. Yat Juhoshi, huh? not Juhoshi. Yat Juhoshi. So, Yat Juhoshi becomes whatever you are offering. The Dasiyat, whatever you give. Yat Tapasyasi, whatever you uh, do, Tapasya, your energy of Tapasya. Kaunteya, he son of Kunti, Tat Kurushwa, break it up, Tat plus Kurushwa, that you do an offering. So, Kurushwa is a form of the Atma Nepadam that we will be, that we have looked at a little bit uh, briefly in some other occasions, but we will uh, do a greater study of that. Um, and so, Tat Kurushwa, Madarpanam, huh? so Mat Arpanam, Madarpanam, Mat plus Arpanam, so that is a Vyanjana Sandhi or a sandhi of consonant with a vowel madarpanam so whatever thou doest whatever thou enjoyest whatever you sac thou sacrificest whatever thou givest whatever energy of tapasya of the soul's will or effort thou puttest forth make it an offering unto me says krishna talking of the power of surrender the mother says a detailed surrender means the surrender of all the details of life even the smallest the most insignificant in appearance and this means to remember the divine in all circumstances. Whatever we think, feel or do, we must do it for him as a way of coming close to him, to be more and more what he wants us to be, capable of manifesting his will in perfect sincerity and purity, to be the instruments of his love. So a mother was a spiritual collaborator of Sri Aurobindo 
and I'd just like to mention that when she's talking of his here, it has nothing to do with the creator being conceived as a male or something like that. Uh, she's just using the his in a generic term. But uh, what is important is that there is this light within e each of us, which is what the word divine means, coming from the root div to shine that we have studied as a verb. So uh, that there is that light of knowledge within us. And if we allow that light to guide us, our lives will spontaneously be more illuminated and free. So with the same idea, Atma Jnanam Astute. So dive deep into your being and uh, the solution and the answers to a lot of our questions lie in there. So Atma Jnanam Astute.